All right, good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to the Wegmans LPGA Championship. My name is Craig Can. I am joined in on this stage uh, this afternoon by three members of the victorious international crown team who played for Spain. And we figured we'd bring them in this afternoon, not only to talk about this golf course and this major, but also kind of the, the way things have gone since that, uh, that great event for you all. So Carlotta Segandas to my left, Belen Motho, and we've got Atahara Munoz. We'll take some questions, so if you want to raise hands in just a few moments, we've got microphones in here. But let's start um, with the most recent, which is this major championship and this golf course. I would assume you've been out there, and let's get some thoughts. Start with you, Carlotta. Yeah, I just played 18 holes, and I really like the course. I like it better than last year because I think the fairways are a bit wider, and then the greens are a bit smaller, but the course is in great shape, and I think it's going to be a very nice week. Very big test. Your thoughts, Melen? I agree with Carlota. I, I think it's a better, not a better course. I just like it better than last year. Uh, same. I got a little dizzy last year with those narrow fairways. <laughs> and uh, it's still a great challenge, this golf course, because you have really short par fives that you can make eagles and birdies, but then you have very challenging long par threes um, with really crazy greens. And I think... Um, being smart on those part threes is going to be the key for this week. Alpha? I love the golf course. Um, I, I love wider golf courses of the tee. And um, I'm normally pretty straight, but I'm way more straighter when the fairways are a little wider. So I, I love that. And it's, it's playing pretty firm. So hopefully we don't get much rain. I, I love how it's playing right now. And, and I really like the second shots. You have, to, you have to be pretty precise. You don't want to be long or sometimes you don't you really can short side yourself so it's going to be a great test and the golf the golf course is in amazing shape so i think we're in for a treat this week okay let's talk international crown a little bit you were actually just in spain is that correct yeah. so tell me and for all of you what has it been like since you all walked away wearing those crowns on sunday in baltimore what was it like at home for you it was amazing. I mean, everyone was saying congrats, and uh, not only my home course, but I mean, in, in Madrid, the Federation, everyone was really happy, and everyone watched it on, on TV. And I think it was, uh, it was really good for the golf in Spain because all the girls saw it, so I think it's going to grow up, and, and it's just a, an amazing feeling winning with your friends, and very, very happy, and I can't wait for for the next next one. So you get off the plane, people stop you immediately, lots of autographs, big media. What was that like for you? We're not Japan. <laughs> no, that, that doesn't happen, no. Didn't happen? No, I mean, in my home course, yeah, everyone, congrats, well done. We saw you on TV, but it's not like Japan or Korea or here in the States. So we have some work to do in Spain, is that what you're saying? A lot of work, yeah. Okay. Uh, Belen, your thoughts on, on what it's been like for you since the victory? Well, I, I stayed in Florida, I didn't get the chance to go to Spain, but I wouldn't be stopped in the airport either. Um, I think it was great. I think even every tournament, even last week, you get all the volunteers, every single volunteer followed the international crown they all said we had such an incredible coverage from the media that that was huge i mean people are from everywhere that none expected are saying congrats we were rooting for spain which is obvious after united states lost and um i think it was huge i think it was just because of the, the coverage the the golf channel did for us it was really big Atha, I don't know if you need any more exposure right now. Your commercial was on, I think, 300 or 400 times uh, during the PGA Championship. But what's it been like for you? It's actually been, it been, it's, it's been incredible. Um, I did so many interviews the next few days. Um, it's going to sound bad, but I was almost overwhelmed by how many people wanted an interview back home. And we actually made, I don't know if they know, but we made the front page in one of the biggest sports newspaper which is huge because golf would never make it not even the guys make it it's always soccer no more. they do something even if they are not in season or whatever that they'll be on on the front page so that was pretty big for us and uh, it's been amazing you know now it's finally synced in and you know i'm just so proud of having won that tournament with these girls